Dear Scorpio, Dear Taurus, This is your combined maxi reading at the equinox as you face and balance each other across the calendar, the zodiac wheel. And I pulled out a bunch of your cards. Um, so the Scorpio tarot card referent is death. Remember these can all shift too as I keep talking about the shifts we're making in all the old correspondences, but in any case, for now and traditionally, Taurus is seen as the Hierophant or associated with it and Scorpio with death change. Okay. And how I'm looking at these cards is the deliverance of change and then the ratification of change. And I wanted to point out this deck in which death looks like a journey and sort of a, a way station, a still point, a, even as it's moving, but a place, this veil, you know, the sail looks kind of like a veil and a misunderstanding here, but a place in which misunderstandings may come to rest. Um, and that card, and that deck reminds me of, it also reminds me of the Six of Swords and I've been talking a lot in all my videos about this being a very Six of Swords time of profound and practical change. And Again, looking at this deck, at first I could not find, for some reason when I was shuffling through, I couldn't find the Hierophant. So I just took out this card, which is government. Because I don't worry about the correspondences that much with this deck. I like to be more open in my reading of it, because it, that goes along with what I've been saying everywhere about how we need to remember when we're moving into new stories, new patterns, we're ceasing to reinscribe past trauma, past heartache, past cruelty, past unfairness, past imprecision, past ways of trying to hold ourselves in these positions that are not natural, that are not aligned. For as Josh, Joss Whedon says, Equality is like gravity. And as Vine Deloria says, Vine Deloria Jr. says, we should be seeking to create forms of existence in which everyone has a sense of identity and integrity. And then when I found the actual five card, the Hierophant in this deck, which is the Cherokee de Dante that a friend sent me out of the blue a while ago, and I've only just started really using it. It used to really freak me out. <laughs> in any case, when I found the actual Hierophant card, it was hope. Hope between generations this journey toward change, and what I got from the ancestors for you. Two of Cups. The ways in which we care for each other. And now I'm going to pull some cards, some more cards for your Equinox, Maybon, and Full Moon. It's a big weekend. These are big times. 